Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Haley and I'm the creator of Minimal Style Club and I like to talk about a minimal style aesthetic when building your wardrobe. I also love to talk about luxury shopping, vintage luxury shopping, and do unboxings. So if you like any of those things, make sure to click subscribe down below and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. All right, so before we jump into the video, I wanna to talk to you guys about jewelry I just got because it's so cute and I'm obsessed. So the jewelry is from Ana Luisa. I love this packaging that it came in and let me show you because it is the perfect pouch for storing the jewelry, but then also when you travel, I don't have a jewelry vanity case or anything yet. So this is actually like really perfect because it has two sections on the inside of this larger one, which I think is great because you can throw in like your necklaces and then like your earrings in the back and not get them all mixed up. But I really, really love it. And I know it's gonna keep my jewelry safe as well, which that's just like an, an additional point for me because I love good packaging. All right, so the first thing that I got is something I've been looking for for a really long time and it is a flat like chain necklace and I love this one because it's super light and it also has this really really cute charm detail also love that Ana Luisa makes their stuff out of recycled materials because I love when businesses are sustainable so so this is definitely a really good layering necklace and this I believe is sterling silver dipped in 14 karat gold so it's not gonna tarnish, it's not gonna wear, it's like hypoallergenic, I love that. Next item that I got is the cutest baby freshwater pearl necklace ever. I have been dying to find one of these because I wanted to achieve the like going to Nikki Beach, St. Bart's like vibe, going on a beach vacation vibe. And I feel like this is just so cute and it's like a way to make your jewelry look a little more like relax because if you're wearing like all gold all the time i feel like this is a good way to break it up but it's still really elegant and i also love how all of the pearls are misshapen because they are freshwater pearls so i love that detail i don't want all of the pearls to be like the exact same shape and size because i feel like it makes it a little bit too like classic looking versus just adds like a little bit of edge to it and i like that and then i also got a matching bracelet again the freshwater pearls that are a little misshapen i think that it's so cute and i love that it has again like the 14 karat gold dipped clasp and chain and everything on the side so i will be wearing these to add to my bracelet stack so I'm really excited to wear these two pieces together. And then the last thing, I'm actually wearing them. I love these little earrings. They are almost like ear crawlers. I like how they kind of elongate, like go up your ear a little bit, but they're so dainty and light and they are a great like everyday earring. I usually, when I go out and like dress up my outfits a little more, I'll wear like a larger earring, but I need a really good everyday earring. And if you're someone that has multiple earrings that you like to wear at once, I love these as like a foundation to start with. And then you can add other earrings in like up your ear, which is so cute, which they are doing a Mother's Day sale online right now. It's like buy one, get one 60% off, which is amazing. And the prices are already insane. Like everything that I got was under a hundred dollars. So thank you again. So thank you again, Ana Luisa, for sponsoring this video. I am obsessed with the jewelry. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about the Hermes Shiper sandals, doing a review for you guys, and if I think that they're worth investing in. I'm a big advocate of finding brand new in box with tags, like luxury items on a handful of websites. So I often use Vestier Collective because they authenticate anything over $500, I think it is. I also love the Real Real. I also love Fashion File. I think that they're amazing and they authenticate all of their items. So these are some of the places that I shop and I'll tell you where I got these and for how much and my experience with it. All right, so let's take a look at the actual sandals first. So these are the Hermes Shiper sandals. These are in black leather. I think it is 1000% worth investing in. If I could afford to buy like 20 pairs, I would because I think that while they're more of a dad sandal vibe, like with the chunkiness, they are just so comfortable. They're amazing. And as you can see, I've gotten these pretty beat up and dirty. They do clean very easily, but they have the classic Hermes H logo here in the actual design of the sandal. And then this is going to be Velcro, which I think is actually really nice because they're super easy to adjust. Um, and I know you might think that like buying this expensive of a sandal, like the Velcro would cheapen it, but 
honestly, you can't tell that they're Velcro at all when you're wearing them. And I think that it's just a lot more comfortable. So they are leather on the upper part of the shoe and then the actual sole is gonna be more of like a rubber, which I think makes them more durable overall. And then, sorry, the bottom, I heavily wear these every single day, multiple times a day. So the bottoms have gotten really dirty, but again, they're like a rubber sole in the bottom of the shoe. So I think that, again, makes them super durable. Now, I am a huge proponent of like wearing my luxury items. I don't like to keep them in the box looking pretty on the shelf. But while these are really expensive sandal, I wear them a ton. And I would say I probably wear them like five times a day because I go to walk my dogs and I'm like running to the grocery store, grabbing coffee, wherever. And I always just reach for these, especially in the spring and summer. I even wear these into the fall. The pros would be that they are super comfortable. They're extremely durable. Obviously I need to clean these black ones a little bit, but I just use kind of like a wet paper towel on the rubber part. And then I use a leather cleaner and a conditioner on the leather part here. And it's only had and I'll show you guys up close. They've only had very minimal creasing in the leather. Um, and I have worn these to the beach. I've worn these in the water. I've taken them on vacations to Europe and just walked in them for hours. And I have never ever gotten like a blister on my foot or had them, you know, like poke in certain places on the top of your feet. Like they're, they are so comfortable. So I would say that like, if you're gonna invest in a good spring and summer sandal that you are going to have for years, get these. I would say, 1000% worth investing in. And like I said, these are the Shipra sandals, but they do have another version. Cannot think of the name right now, but I will flash a picture up here. And they actually have another band that comes out to wrap around your heel. I haven't tried those yet, but I feel like they would be just as comfortable. But I love that these are a slide version. I feel like they can easily elevate any outfit um, because they, I feel like they are perfect to go into your closet and worth investing in overall because they will match with anything in your closet. Obviously the black leather is a really good option to start with. I pair it with so many things. I love wearing them with oversized jeans and trousers. I love wearing them with linen dresses for the summer. I also think that they're great with jean shorts and then also with like a satin or silk slip skirt I think is really beautiful. So they go with everything. So that's my overall review of what I think of them. So these do run true to size. I am a size seven and they fit a seven perfectly. I feel like you could get away with like a seven and a half or an eight even if you're a size seven and go up um, because you can adjust with, you know, the Velcro strap. But, you know, these ones definitely fit true to size. And I purchased these ones from Bestie Collective, I believe about a year and a half ago and they were authenticated. Um, they came with the box and the tags. They were brand new, never worn. They came with the dust bags, everything. I believe I paid a little over a thousand dollars for them, which is much higher than what they usually run if you were to purchase them on the Hermes website or in the store. And this is a product that is constantly sold out now, but there are rare occasions where Hermes will do a restock and you can actually purchase these online. So if you find your size online on the Hermes website, I highly recommend getting them there because on the pre-loved and resale luxury market, they tend to increase the price a bit more, which is true with almost all Hermes items. Unless you find like a really damaged pair, um, I would probably say they're less than retail price, but I assumed and expected to pay higher than retail price when purchasing on the pre-loved luxury market, but they've been sold out for a really long time when I was looking for them. So I just jumped on the opportunity to get them. And then I wanted to actually do an unboxing with you guys. I have already unboxed this and worn these maybe two times, but I wanted to show you that I got a new color in the Shiper sandals. So again, I purchased these from Vestier Collective and you can see that they came with, you know, the dust bag and everything. It came really nicely packaged. It came with, you know, the ribbon that goes around the box usually, but I've already unboxed it. So I'll just show you guys out of the dust bag. I got the beige suede Shipra sandals. So our leather in the uppers, but they have suede on the top. So it's super, super soft suede, really, really good quality. Wouldn't expect anything less from Hermes um, because their leather quality is what they are known for. And I'm gonna be a lot more careful with these ones than I am with the black ones just because these ones are all leather have no suede and i feel like i could get away a little bit more with wearing these more heavily and these ones doesn't mean i'm not going to wear them as heavily but i will not be taking these to the beach like i do my black ones i will not be taking these into the water like i do my black ones um so i will be a lot more delicate with these ones just because the suede 
is much harder to clean and maintain, I think, than the leather. I feel like they are the perfect neutral beige color for spring and summer, and they will go with so many things. I'm already planning to wear them with my white trousers, um, a white slip skirt. They obviously will go with black and other shades of brown and like a neutral linen for the summer. I've also had my eye on these suede pair, but they have some amazing, amazing colorways that just came out and I am trying so hard to not buy more. You guys, like these are my favorite shoe that I have in my closet and it's to the point where I don't reach for anything else. Um, and so my other shoes, especially for like spring and summer are kind of just sitting in the closet because I wear these constantly. And I'll show you guys, I love this blue suede pair. I think they're stunning. I feel like I want to branch out and get like a couple colors now that I have, you know, two good neutral pairs. So I love these rose pink ones. I even love like the orange and the pink together. I think they're so fun. Like, they're just a great addition to your closet. So I probably will buy one more pair for the summer. So that was my review of the Hermes Shiper sandal. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to click the notification bell for our upcoming videos and I'll see you guys next time. Again, Anna Luisa for sponsoring this video. I am obsessed with the jewelry. I love that it's sustainable. I love that the price point is so achievable for these that are dipped in 14 karat gold and like recycled sterling silver. I really, really love the designs too. And they're just such good foundational pieces when curating like a good necklace stack or a bracelet stack or even an earring stack. So I love it and I'll definitely be ordering more.